Should you build bubble? Short answer, yes. Long answer. This entire video. Bubble is a four-star protector from Sargon. This little troublemaker is a daughter of the local Sargon tribal warrior. On her father request, she is undergoing treatment and become a reserve operator for Rhodes Island. Although this girl's codename is Bubble, but her physical strength and endurance is as solid as Boulder. As a protector, Bubble can instantly block three enemies without any promotion. And because of her class, she has a high defense and a high max HP. Her attack is pretty low, but Bubble's ability had nothing to do with her attack stats. And she have no resistance. Moving to her talent. Enemies that attack Bubble will have their attack reduced for a few seconds. As long as she can survive the initial hit, the next enemy attack will be reduced. So it will greatly increase her survivability. And this is her potentials upgrade list. It's a decent upgrade and it's easy to get her potentials. Though I was hoping for a talent improvement, but overall it's fine. And currently, she doesn't have a module upgrade. And then moving to her skills. Her first skill. The first skill that will increase her defense. A very simple skill, if you already promote her to elite one, make sure to use this next skill. And then her second skill. This what makes Bubble special. Pretty much another version of Hoshigoma and Thorn skill, with one extra unique ability. She will stop attacking, greatly increase her defense, and taunt all enemies making her being targeted by enemy attacks. Additionally, when attacked she will deal physical damage equal to some percentage of her defense, giving Bubble a convenient way to counter attack that enemy. A skill that will be useful in some strategy or for newer players who might have trouble with deployment order. And since the damage she dealt is based on some of her defense, you can further boost it her defense by using other operators skill. Like Shining, Roberta, A and more. And beware of when you activate it, the skill got a poor uptime with no initial SP. When talking about mastery, of course you go for her skill too. Since it's what differ her from other defender. And you don't really have to M3 the skill. M1 should be enough. To increase how many amount of death that will be used to counter attack enemy. As for her base skills. The skill 1 will increase capacity limit and reduce morale consumed. The skill 2 is similar like Vermeil base skill. That will increase productivity based on other operators increased capacity limit. Good to partner with someone like Vulcan and Benner. So, will Bubble become a good operator for your team? Bubble offers a unique ability that allow her to decrease enemy attack with her talent. And taunt enemy by using her skill too. However the enemy will only decrease their attacks by a little. And her S2 taunt ability isn't that unique if you can manage your deployment order. Or if there's no enemy that can do ranged attack. But I'm sure her ability will be useful, especially if you love doing redeploy. And she is quite useful for newcomer. With her big defense and HP. Also she is cheap to upgrade since she's a 4 star. So grab your potted plants. And gift it to this little troublemaker for a snack. That should be all. Adios.